sound. Um, I'm going to teach you some fun effects, but well, not actually effects, but some things you can use to spice up your video. Well, I'm going to show you these controls. This one, I'm definitely sure you know because I think they have them in a lot of programs. So this is to undo and this is to redo the trash can I showed you earlier to delete, to cut, uh, to split your video. This function can be used to like, if you want to place an effect or like a certain pitch and like, I'll show you what pitch is in a moment or you can also hover them, hover over them if you want to see like for what they are for. So. Um, this is your playhead, the little red thing, uh, if you want to cut at a certain location where the playhead is, it will cut right there. Now, crop. Crop is another way to like adjust the size, make it smaller, make it bigger. So you usually take it from one corner, then drag, and now it will only show the area that's inside the box. Pan and zoom. This is if you want to like zoom in to like an area. You can choose when. So let's try that out. It's cropped and it has zoom. So let's try that out. Your media. The media is like the height zoom. But I'd suggest you add a transition to that. So like it doesn't appear so sudden. So that's your crop pan and zoom. Your speed controls. These I kind of use a lot when there's nobody talking in the video, and it will probably get boring for your viewers to watch like um, a bunch of silence. So no, slow is if you want to slow down your video. Uh, 0.1 is like the slowest you can get and then it makes your video super super extra long I'm going to undo that because I like normal um, then fast I uh, fast is like the fastest you can get 100 that makes your video like super short Yeah, now my voice sounds all mixed up, like <laughs> Yeah, like that. It sounds really weird, so I'm going to undo that. Wait, mm, yeah, that's fast and normal if you want to, like, everything. If you want your speed to go back to normal. Freeze frame, if you want to, like, freeze it. Reverse. You can, like, flip your video around. So, if, um... I filmed my crazy brother Nico running, uh, then if I put reverse, he'd run backwards. So um, I'm just curious, I want to see how my voice sounds in reverse. And it will ask you to create a proxy file for smooth playback and you choose yes or else it will like, kind of work. And now, uh, Oh my gosh, I sound like an alien with the reverse so I'll put it the right side. And if you want to make your, like your own speed for your video, you can add like a 1 is normal speed. If you want to speed a little up, I put a 1.25. I'm going to see if I can get to a thousand. Oh wait, no, maximum speed is 1,000. I mean, I'm going to get tired. You can reverse speed, rip out edit. I can like... Yep, maximum speed is 100, so I'm going to... Place. I'm going to place it at 1, where it was. Just going to set 1, there. So, those are your speed controls. Color editing. You can place like um, cool effects from your uh, favorite movies. So, um, Batman, Dark Film, Gravity, Harry Potter, Star Wars, and a bunch of cool effects for your videos. Especially if you're like 
playing a game, like beyond you're having a gaming channel and you want to do some color editing, you can also use that. If you want to place it only at a certain part and uh, not the whole video, you have to cut like I taught you to. So, okay. And this is for the uh, other video editing. The foreign composition, that's like for that's how it's like automatic. Stabilization, if your video is a little uh, shaky and you want to stabilize it. Uh, chroma key, that's another word for green screen. Uh, green screen is like most common. So that's kind of like it changes your color color of your video so I'll select it's not working oh yeah I have to select it first so um, the green screen kind of changes the color of your video I'll make it this blue pink it changes the color so I don't want it like that so I'm going to reset it uh, drop shadow okay so that's oh wait I forgot to show you that's only the video editing now audio editing, this sometimes I use in my videos, so I'm going to uh, place it here on this one, go to audio, fade in is when you like, uh, you go from black to your video and fade out is from your video, fade in is for the beginning, fade out is for the, wait, ignore that please, fade out is for the, from the video to black, that's for the ending, the pitch, the uh, zero is like the the automatic number. Zero is like your regular voice, no advanced editing added to it. Um, so the higher the number, um, I usually like to put it at six or seven. It makes you sound like uh, one of uh, one of the squirrels from Alvin and the Squirrels. Wait, actually I'm going to lower the music. If your voice is kind of like low, you like to lower the music. Yeah, so those are your uh, audio editing. Uh, if you want, then you can press this arrow to reset it. Then the lower the number, like the lower the pitch, you sound like, uh, I don't know, you sound weird here. Yeah, I sound weird like that. I don't know why, it just sounds weird. So I already said that. We move background noise. I won't teach you that one because it's kind of like too complicated. So I'm just going to do the basic ones. Um, so if you want to like, uh, there's, I don't know, your mom cooking. Uh, I used one of these in my videos. Um, I removed the mid sounds from my the beef frying and so this is the one if you want to remove your background noise if you're like on a plane and you want to remove the plane's noise of the motors so that's to remove the background noise and motion uh, that's how you can make your video like fly uh, to like appear on the screen like this hi everyone Welcome to my next video here with Isa. It flies in and then it zooms in. So I'm going to uh, undo that. So there we go. We go back to this. So that's your motion, like transitions for the whole video. Color, you can adjust the temperature. Uh, that's what Mr. Zamorana taught us. Warm colors, cool colors. Um, I usually have it at zero all the time. Contrast, Wait, contrast, white, black. I also have it at zero. I I have everything at zero. Separation. How much color there is. Brightness. If your like camera or phone is not that good, you can adjust your brightness. Uh, right now I'm recording the screen, so I don't need that much brightness. 3D, UFT. Uh, these are like more effects than the ones I showed you in the color. 
Uh, so this is basically all of these combined, I think. So I'll just put nine. Advance. Okay, so these are basically all of them. Okay, so we're too complicated. I'm not going to put that because it's going to confuse you so much. And I'm going to reset that. So my video is not weird. Okay, so that's the little uh, man over there. Like a monitor. Please, uh, you can also use them to access that. Um, this is to uh, lock this little lock right here is to uh, lock like so if you don't want anything in your video to move now so I can't move it even though I'm like wearing a mouse all over the screen so uh, so you don't mess that um, row in the timeline up now to lock this one and you click the lock again to unlock it unlock it you click this one to uh, mute the music for a while to see how this uh the video's audio sounds today i will teach you how to yep so then you click again and that's all for today we covered all, all the film where i hoped you like this video and subscribe to my channel bye